In the Bible, it says this in Joel 3.10, Let the weak say, I am strong. I visited a woman in the hospital one time, and she was very weak, not recovering from surgery as she should. And she read that, and she said over and over again, I am strong. With every step that she took in physical therapy, she said, I am strong. And literally, the life of God in her strengthened and renewed her. And she was filled with new vitality and health. Well, my friend, we are meant to be strong. We're meant to be vital. We're meant to be healthy and zestfully alive. But we, we may not always feel this way, especially at those times that we feel that we're lacking in strength, that we're lacking in vitality. Well, in those times, we need to hold on to the idea of life, to affirm and to reaffirm ourselves with the powerful, renewing life of God that is within us. One person said how she turned to the Bible, searching for reassurance because of a long siege of weakness and ill health. She came upon the text that said the same thing as my other friend found. Let the weak say, I am strong. This was her clue to health. And she began to declare to herself, I am strong. And she too regained her health and her strength. There is a capacity for renewal in every cell of your body. There is a willingness on the part of your body to respond to the spoken words of faith and the spoken words of truth. You can take your stand for life and you can know that all the forces of your being, they're going to respond. You're meant to be strong. You are meant to be vital. You're meant to be zestfully alive. God is your strength and God's power will heal you.